Hi, everyone. Welcome to My AI Live. My AI Live. My AI Live. We do this every Monday through Friday. And what we do is we show you how to use the incredible My AI system. We also give you tips and tricks on social media, how to become consistent, how to create more relationships. We answer your questions. When you come here each day, you're going to learn some new things. And really, we put up this five-minute timer so you can do the work yourself. There is nothing worse than going to an event and learning all these new things and not putting them into practice, right? There's nothing worse than going on a Zoom, learning some great training and not putting it into practice. And so what we're doing is we're giving you the opportunity right here to become very consistent in social media. What happens when you become so uh, consistent in social media? You start many more conversations, which of course gives you more opportunities for your business, for your product, to sell your product, and collaborations. I got to tell you, I haven't applied for jobs in a long time. Now, I have my own business for a long time as well. But before that, I didn't apply for jobs. I got offers for things and for collaborations because of relationships. If you are having to apply for things, you do not have as much of a network as you could, okay? So we're going to help you build an incredible network. We're going to help you build those opportunities. And so for our brand new people, let me tell you what's going to happen. The very first thing we're going to do, oh, for our brand new people also, I should introduce myself. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Elizabeth Larson. I am a personal and business transformation coach, entrepreneur. I have several businesses, extremely successful, and I do this because I love this. I love helping you get consistent with where you want to be. Erica Cole, I have missed you so much, girl. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to see you. Wow, beautiful. Oh, you're gorgeous. I am so happy to see you. Okay, glad you are here. Okay, so the very first thing we're going to do is I'm going to show you how the My AI system is going to help you with your social media. I'm going to give you a short demo of how to do that. And today's demo is actually going to be on the phone. So I want to show you how to use the mobile version of this. Now, you can use it on the computer or you can use it on your phone. When I'm at home, most of the time I use it on the computer. However, I go out, I travel, I'm going out to eat, doing other different things. So I really want to be able to have that on the go. So today's is going to be a mobile. As soon as we're done with that, we're going to put a five a minute timer up. You're going to start making your posts. If you are a person who's been here a lot, you can go ahead and start making your posts now. And with your posts, if you want to showcase your post that was made with my AI, if you didn't make it with the My AI, it, it doesn't qualify, okay? I want the ones that we were made with the My AI. Drop your links in the chat so I can pull them up easily, especially if you're not friends with me or following me on Facebook. And if you're not friends or following me on Facebook, please do so I can like watch your posts and help you and comment on your stuff and uh, help you get some boosts as well. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to share my screen. And... Let's go ahead and do that. And when you first log into the My AI system, you're going to first log into now.site. For everybody who's new, you log into now.site. This is going to be your dashboard. You're going to see a lot of different things that you can do here. The one that we focus on in this meeting is this one right here, create a social post. So we're going to create a social post and we have several different things that we can do. We've got caption and suggested image. This means that I know what I want a post about, but I don't have a photo to match it. So I want the AI to find a photo for me. This one is caption my image. This is if I have a photo. Maybe I... Um, took a photo of my food or, uh, you know, friends or a selfie or the sunsets. I, I posted sunsets yesterday. Um, any of those things will be captioned my image. Now, the next one is caption my video. The only difference between caption my image and caption my video is that you're either captioning your image or your video. It's the exact same thing. We just made the second button because people were getting confused. So maybe you made a video and you're going to put it up on TikTok, YouTube, uh, you did a Facebook reel or an Instagram reel. Perfect. 
caption my video. You can put that there. And here's the thing about this. It will, you'll describe your video right here. And then you will tell what you want the post to be about. What is it that you want the AI to write for you about your video? Now, here's the thing that's so important about this. This is not going to give you a video. That's actually the number one question I get about this. It's like, why am I not getting a video? This is for when you have a video already, not to give you a video. Maybe someday we'll have videos that are given, but right now that's not what this is for. The last one, of course, or not the last one, second to last right here is short text-only posts. These are great for things like, hey, I'm going out to dinner. Should I have tacos or burritos? Uh, this, uh, hey, I'm going on vacation. Where should I go? They're great, quick conversation starters for Facebook that are, and you can use them anywhere, but I love these on Facebook because they're just very quick, very easy. I can ask a, uh, a question and you get people starting conversations on your, uh, through the comments. And then you take those, of course, to Messenger. And then from Messenger, you can take them to a phone call or a Zoom. So I have built a tremendous business doing this, and we're going to show you how to do that as well. Last one, but least is not is surprise me. Surprise me is for when you do not feel inspired to do any posts on social media. Maybe you don't know what you want to post. Maybe you're like, I don't, I don't know what I want to post today. And if we're real honest with each other, the days that we don't really feel like posting, what do we do? We don't post, right? If we're not inspired, we don't know what we're going to post. We're not going to go figure it out. We're going to go do something else, right? And then we lose our consistency on social media. So by using the surprise me, you are very, it's so, so easy to get a post made for super quick for you. The AI is looking at everything it learned about you, and it's going to make a terrific post for you. So you stay consistent on social media. And of course, we've showcased a lot of the surprise me posts. Uh, through the trainings. Now, next, we are going to, I'm going to come over here to my phone and I'm going to share my phone screen. And then we are going, I'm going to show you this on the app. And I'm actually going to make my post today on the app. So let me share my screen, go to iPhone and here. Okay. So now I'm going to open up my iPhone and mirror my phone onto Zoom. Well, I guess. There we go. All right. So here it is on mobile. Now, what you're going to see is, I love Apple security, but it's like, really, this is not the time for this. All right. Zoom. All right. Let's do that. Okay. There we go. Now it should let me. All right. Spotlight. Okay. So right here, we're going to add create a social post. This is what you should see right here. Right here, you can have the caption with suggested image, just like we talked about. Caption in my image. Caption my video and the short only text, right? Today, what I'm going to do is caption my own image because I took a funny image yesterday. Have you ever seen something at a restaurant that was so ridiculous? You're like, why, why did you, why did you do that? Why did you put that in there? Like, why? Okay. I, I got to show you because it's just too hilarious. Okay. So what's the image? Now, the thing I love about the app is I can voice to text, right? So describe my image. My image is of an animal's rear end, period, at a restaurant. Yes, that's really true. I'm not kidding. Maybe we'll actually put it in animals, but. And then what I wanted, what do I want my post to be about? Have you ever seen things at restaurants that just make you wonder why? Question mark. Like the most ridiculous things? Question mark. My beautiful friend and I went out to eat and this is what we saw, period. Restaurants amazing. But every time I see this, I truly wonder why? Question mark. What have you seen at a restaurant that makes you wonder why? Question mark. Put the comments down below. Okay, so I want something to the effect of this, right? But I want the AI to clean it up for me, put a fun emojis in there because guess what? I'm not great at figuring out the right emojis, right? So we're gonna do this. So I'm gonna go done and we're gonna generate. 
Okay, so the AI is going to go through everything it knows about me. It's going to go through my profile. It's going to go through uh, all the posts that I've made before. It's going to go through all of these different things that it has learned about me. And so, and then it's going to, as it's searching through that, it's coming up with a post that it feels that I will like. Now it takes just a few minutes or, you know, not too long to do this because it's actually looking through all of the information. So it's not just like something where, you know, some of the things out there where you could just throw something and say, make me a post and it just makes you some random post. It's actually learned about me. It's learned what I like, what I dislike, what's important to me, what's not important to me. And it puts all of that together for me. And, oh, there we go. Okay, so now I've got my post, right? And so with my post, what a day it's been. Grab some good grub with my dearest friend at an amazing restaurant, but something so out of the blue caught my eye. Yes, you guessed it. An animal's butt hanging at the restaurant. What? Wait, what? Have you ever had those why, why moments at a restaurant that leaves you absolutely baffled? This was one of them. As someone who enjoys trying new cuisine and exploring different cultures, this experience added a bit of humorous twist to my gastronomic journey that I'll never I'll remember for a while. So spill the beans, everyone. What's the most unpres uh, unpredictable site you've ever come across at a restaurant? Sharing is fun. Drop your stories in the comments below. Restaurant Adventures. Love it. Okay. So I've got this. I'm on Facebook. I'm going to click post, right? And then post. It's going to open up my Facebook app right here. And then I'm going to come to the top and I'm going to paste this right here. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get my photo and I'm going to do this one. Um, let's see which one of these, this one and this one. Okay. All right. Now, come on, guys. Who puts this at a restaurant, right? It's like, it's so hilarious. But anyways, so here's my post. And now I am going to add on one hashtag for my own hashtags. Hashtag E transforms you. Hashtag extraordinary you. Now I'm putting the extra hashtags in there because one of them is my handle for everything. And then the other one is my community that I build with training, teaching, you know, stuff like that. So I want both the hashtags in there because I want people to be able to find other things that I do. Right. So let's go ahead and make the post and post on here. And there we go. Now I don't want to create a reel right now. So here we go. There's the post right there. Lots of fun, and and that's a that is a that is a scroll stopping photo, right? It's like wh what is that? You you just got to stop and look and go whoa. So that's going to create a lot of conversations. And again, that's my goal is to start conversations, because through conversations is how I build my business businesses. Okay, so let's go ahead. Yeah, Nina, it is. Yeah, it was so fun. Gay and I had just had a blast last night. My friend's name is Gay. And um, she is amazing and uh, just love her dearly. We've been friends for years. So, okay, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to put the five minute timer up. We're going to go ahead and do our own posts. You can do it on the computer. You can do it on mobile, I, whichever way you prefer. You can do a surprise me. You can capture your own photo, whatever it is. Post at least to one. If at one platform, try to post to multiple ones. We're here to get you consistent in your social media. So we're going to put up the timer. When we come back, we're going to showcase some posts. If you want your post to be one of the ones showcased it in the time that we have today, please drop the link to it in the chat um, or make sure that you are friends with me or following me so I can find it more easily because if it's hard to find, it will take too much time and we want to make this and show off as many people as possible. So let's go ahead and get going. And uh, Blake Stroll, I'll make sure to do the music right. There we go. And yeah, I got to have that beat. Exactly. Right. OK. How did that go? If you posted on one platform, I want to see ones in the chat. If you posted on two platforms, let me see two. If you do three, I want three. And if it's four, do four. 
Okay. So, and I know some of you have had sixes and sevens because you're posting on all the platforms real quick. That's fabulous. Look at all the ones. We've got some fours going here. We got some twos. Yay. Really great job. Okay. We're going to showcase some posts real quick. We do have a hard stop today because we do have an announcement for you. Where's Adrian? Adrian, are you here? Raise your hand if you're here. Where are you? He has not made it here yet. Okay. So Adrian's got new features for you today. Brand new stuff being released. I mean, what's what I look at the what happens, right? It's fast. It's it, and we're always moving. We're always giving you guys new things. So we've got new stuff for you today. So you are definitely wanting to be on uh, the next meeting, which is going to start at 10 a.m. Mountain Time. So that's 12 noon Eastern, 9 a.m. Pacific. But let's showcase some uh, things first. And let's go over to Blakester first, my partner in success. Hi, Blakester. Good morning, my friend. I uh, I wanted to share mine because I thought it was pretty fun. I did okay. a, a surprise me post this morning. Okay, beautiful. And, Let's go and share the screen. Yeah, oh my gosh. It's, and it's already gotten a bunch of comments and stuff on it. Is it this one right here? Yeah. This is stunning. Yeah. And the picture of the image was picked out by AI. Everything was done just with the surprise me. Wow. That is incredible. Okay, so let's read the post. Uh, did you know I almost shared a birthday with the alleged moon landing? Yes, folks. July 19th, 1969 is a historic day. When I was born, it was the day before that special day of July 20th, 1969. That is clouded in doubt for many like myself. What do you think? Was it a giant leap for mankind or just a small step in a Hollywood studio? Let me stir up some debate in the comments below. Oh my gosh, what a great post, Blakester. <laughs> I mean, and really that's going to start a lot of conversation, right? I love it. I love look it. Look at how quick this, I mean, literally <laughs> look at all of these comments going already. And then you've already got people uh, liking and everything else. This is fabulous. And I love, first of all, <laughs> I love that the surprise me did this for you, but I love that photo. I, I, part I absolutely... of that, just so that you know, right, part of that is because yeah. I trained my AI and I told it that was my birthday and the fact that I did not believe that we've been to the moon. Wow. So clicking that surprise and popping it up, I was like, oh, yeah, this is fantastic. Isn't it incredible how much the AI learns about you and, and what you and what's important to you and, and what you value? Yeah, it's it was yeah. pretty amazing. So fun That's little awesome. one to share with everybody today. I love it. Thanks so much for sharing today, Blakester. Okay, let's go to Nur Jahan. Hi, beautiful. Hey, I just wonder if I can unmute. Okay, I put my link in the chat. If okay, let me go see. grab it real quick. Uh, all right, here we go. And now did you do, what kind of post did you do? A surprise me or you captioned my image? I captioned my image and I did that with mobile so I can add um, multiple oh. photos. Oh, fabulous. You did it with mobile. Okay, so let's go ahead and read this. 26 years ago, my life took a sharp turn with a broken neck. Ooh, but I'm but here I am transformed into the beauty queen that I stand as today. You go, girl. For the times when I doubted my strength, I thought of the phoenix rising from the ashes, stronger, bolder, and beautiful. Mm. In the darkest hour, I find the light within me and gathered the strength to rise again. From pain bloomed passion and it led me to where i stand today leading kbm ministries helping our community thrive despite the trials the smile never left my face and i found the strength in the most unlikely of places let my story inspire you to never give up no matter what trials th life throws you to always strive strive for greatness this is one of the most beautiful posts i absolutely love this Wow, this <laughs> is extremely inspiring. I think like round of applause for this one, right, guys? Everybody? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Thank you for sharing this post. And it's just absolutely beautiful. You're welcome. All right, let's go over to Maria. Hey, Maria. Hi, Maria. Let's see. Did Hi. you put your post in the chat? Uh 
I put one, I have done one post, but I've, uh, I'm changing my, uh, my websites on my uh, website or on the platform on Instagram. So um, I'm Did doing you? that. But I have another question. I hope you can help me with that. Okay, can because, you hold on for one um, second so we could showcase one more post and then we'll go to Q&A? Yes. Since we're doing posts right now. So hold on one second, okay, hon? All right, let me go to the last post. Let's go over to Nina because I know she shared hers in the link and we'll do our last shared post and then we'll go over to Q&A real quick. And there, oh, there you are. Okay. All right, Nina. Hey, beautiful. Okay, right, so let's ch you. check out your post. Which one is it? See, now that's oh. weird because I edited it and see it, it keeps duplicating it. So I didn't even see it did that. So just do the top one. This one right here? Okay. Yeah. Okay. So it's, it's the video that I did of my two clients rather than the stills. So I did video today, but it, oh. it took a while. Fantastic. Okay. So haircuts Thursday, check out this awesome after video showcasing the incredible transformation of my haircut friends, Don and Bradley, uh, Evangeline cottage, Bradley, Greg, I want to have a fresh cut to, Oh, want to have a fresh cut to DM me today and book your appointment. Let's talk about your hair challenges and how I can help you achieve your dream hairstyle. Okay. So let me click on this real quick and, Oh, it's not going to let me fast forward. Is it? Oh, I was hoping it was going to let me fast forward because I wanted to try the before and, and see the before and after. All right. It's just not going to do it in the time I can, but that's beautiful. Now the AI wrote all of that for you, Nina. I, you know, I did some and it did some, it kept sounding Perfect. too formal. So I just kept saying more playful, quite, you know, whatever. Beautiful. Beautiful. Love that. Okay. Wonderful share, Nina. Thanks so much. Thank you. Yay. And again, if you're in California, look Nina up. She's an amazing hairdresser. She works on Hollywood sets and uh, she's uh, styled some pretty incredible people's hair. So if you get the opportunity to work with her, she's a, she's an incredible lady. All right, let's go over here. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and do Q&A now. And I've got about eight minutes for Q&A. So go ahead and raise your hand. Where did she go? I was looking. There you are, Maria. Let's start with you real quick. So, Maria, what is your question? Well, uh, I have a Spanish lady who signed up and she does not speak uh, uh, English. So and she wants to work on her mobile, but I, I don't know how to fix it. You, I, you, you, I want to ask you, how did you do it to get your mobile on desktop? Oh, okay. So you so, share on so Zoom. I have more for I shared on Zoom. So at the bottom of your Zoom screen, when you are the host of the meeting, you'll see a green button that says share screen. You won't see that right now because we don't let people share screen. Yes. So, but when you yeah, share but when, I, I, yeah. Yeah. And 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 you can Google and you can Google the step by step directions after this also. But oh. when you are the host of the Zoom, you'll have a green button that says Share Screen, and then mine's Mac, so it says AirPlay, and so I AirPlay over to my phone. But it's best for that. It's really best to go to Zoom and and uh, look it up on 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 Google Chrome, and it will give you the steps. Okay, I will. Uh, I will do it. <laughs> okay. Thank you. You're Thank welcome, you. hon. All right, let's go over to Kathy for questions. I want to, and and let me remind everybody: questions right now are only regarding social media and my AI. If you have questions about websites, email campaigns, or any other feature of the Now Site platform, that is for the next meeting. We keep this strictly for my AI and social media because it's already such a big subject. We want to make sure to get your questions answered. So let's go over to the beautiful Kathy Mays in San Diego, California. Good morning, beautiful. So my question is, could you please review how you comment back to someone on, with a mm -hmm. using AI on Absolutely. their post? 
Yes, absolutely. In fact, I'm going to showcase one comment that was made on my post that I know that was done with the AI, and then we'll go from there, and then I'll show okay. you exactly how to do it. So I'm going to share my screen. Let's go over here. So I'm going to go over to my profile page. This is my profile page, and I'm going to go down. That's my pin post. Okay. So this is the post I just did, right? And so isn't this a riot? It's just so funny. I love Gay. Yes. She's she's like one of my dearest friends. And we every time we go to this restaurant, it's just like, really? <laughs> so anyways, Wes, Wes, there you are. There's Wes. Wes made a comment right here. He used the AI. And so the comment that he made on my post was, haha, that is hilarious. Can't believe you saw an animal's butt statue at the restaurant. It's definitely a story you won't forget. Have a dynamite day. Fantastic, right? How did he do this? Right. So what you're going to do is you're going to take and copy the post that you want to make a comment on. And you guys try this on my post. Practice on mine. I if you if it gets wrong, I'm not going to judge you for it, you know, but this is a great time to practice. So practice by commenting on my post. You're going to come over here to the home page and right under here it says write a message write a message or a reply. Okay. We're going to click on that. And then we're going to see comment on a social post. When we click on that, I am going to put that in there. And I can leave this blank if I want, I believe. I've never loved it, left, it, left it blank before. So let's try that. So here's the post. And I'm just going to hit generate for a comment. And so it's going to read the post and it's going to look at my info and here's what it posted. Oh, wow. An animal's butt. That certainly beats the sight of broken toilets right in the dining area. Okay. Well, that is true, right? The AI is funny. Sometimes these unexpected moments add a spicy twist to your journey, don't they? Cute little conversation, right? And the AI just did it for me. So if you guys want to, if you're nervous about posting on somebody else's post yet until you're getting used to this, feel free to grab like this post or something and just throw a comment on there and practice. Feel free to practice. I'm fine with that. Uh, did that help, Kathy? Yeah, that's perfect. And I wrote it down this time. So thank you for that. But also just want to say, you know, it's, it's so good just to be on every day, yeah. so that you get like you always start out with a consistency. But right. then you know, you can, you're learning new things every day, and you're getting faster every day, too. So right. there's a lot to being on this call every single day. Yeah, so true, Kathy. And and the neat thing is we do a different kind of posts every day, we have different kinds of topics each day. I mean, literally, you keep coming, you're going to end up being social media experts. You're like going to all be able to start your own like social media company and like, like do social media for other people who just don't want to do this. So what right. do you mean things like that? Right. Perfect. Thank you so much. Hey, you're welcome. Okay. I have got literally a hard stop at 940 per Adrian. So let's try to get these last two questions in super quick. Let's go to Deanna. Yes. Hi. Okay. Uh, when you give us the five minutes to go and do our posts, all of a sudden yours comes up full bore on my my page. So I can't get to now site or Facebook or anything. I can't do anything. So I've learned I have to make my post before this thing happens. Uh, can I tell you how to fix that? I can't work. And I know they said, well, just minimize. Can, can, I, no can I tell you how to fix that? For sake of time, I'm sorry to, for talking over you, but I want to make sure that I can help you. Would you like me to show you how to fix that? Yes, please. Okay, so when the screen pops up, if you click anywhere on the screen and click escape, it will shrink back down. Oh, <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Great, great question though. And great, great statement because other people might've been dealing with the same thing. So thanks for sharing that. Okay, let's try to get Linda in. In a minute. Hey, Linda. Again, I have a hard stop at 940. So sorry if I don't get your questions answered. I will answer them tomorrow. Hey, Linda. Uh-oh. You can't. Yay. Okay, now I can. Thank you. Hi. Okay, so I was wondering if you could go back to Nina's post sure. that she did with the video. Because yep. it a couple of questions. One, why did it do it twice? And I noticed in one of them, the, the wording is in the video itself, and the other one is above it. One was done in Instagram, I think, and one was done in Facebook, and the Instagram and Facebook are still tied together. 
which is why it's duplicating over on the oh, other. Oh, that's why it double. So, okay. Yep. So, so then she, she would either want to turn off the duplication um, or not or post it post in Instagram. On, or only post on one knowing it's going to go right. to both. So yep. go to both. Okay. And that's why I put the cap, the wording. See how the wording there is the on top. The wording's different it, because one was done on one platform and what, and it posted uh, on the other. Okay. Well, thank you. Hey, that you're welcome. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's give it a shot. Ted, I've got 60 seconds. To, what's your question? By the way, I I, I love Martina. Okay. We sorry. Were, we sorry. Got, got, got it. Got it. Sorry. That's my okay. mute was on. Um, so anyway, um, quick question is when you're working with AI in our program here, does AI remember how you're interacting with it yes. for the next post? Yes, this AI, so AI in general, out in the wild, out in the world, when you go to those other platforms, is not doing that. The AI here is actually uh, made so that it is learning about the posts you make, the things you do, the things you say, and everything else. And so it's learning everything about you. And so, yes, it's utilizing everything that it's learned about you prior when it's making a post. So, um, and but as you're, let's say, as you're um, tweaking a post on AI, uh -huh. does it learn yes. that piece yep. of it for, the, for future uh, yep. messages? So as you tell the AI shorten, longer, uh, make this more playful, do these things to it. Yes, it's a learning as each and every time. When you ask it to ask a question, same thing. It's Great. learning every time. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm sorry, everybody. I have a hard stop per Adrian because he's got to get this ready for your next meeting. If I didn't get your question answered, please come back tomorrow. I will be make you the first people to get your questions answered. Meeting starts 12 noon Eastern time, 9 a.m. Pacific. You don't want to miss this. New products, new things are coming for you guys. You want to see the surprise that he's got for you. I was hoping he was going to be here to be able to uh, tell you a little bit about it, but I guess you're just going to have to wait the 20 minutes. So have a great day, y'all. I love you. I will see you tomorrow, 12 noon Eastern, or at 11 a.m. Eastern time, 8 a.m. Pacific for my AI Live. Too many time zones. Whoever can make one. Blakester, make me one time zone for everything, and I'm going to be the happiest person on the planet. Have a great day, everyone. Love y'all. Bye.